Hey coin collectors, today I'll talk about valuable and highly elusive Lincoln cents from 90s. While displaying the circulated specimens as a requisite, we will find out their mintage current value at higher grades and have a look at expensive specimens that sell for hundreds or thousands of dollars at different auctions. So hit subscribe and bell buttons below this video and let's get started. 1994 is a very good year. For Lincoln pennies, other than color varieties, it features highly sought after double die reverse variant. But first, let's start with regular struck pennies. There were over 6.5 billion 1994 P. Lincoln cents struck for circulation, therefore, obtaining an example should be very easy. The only condition where it becomes scarce is in MS68 or higher. At Miss A68, they are worth over $275 as for PCGS price guide. The highest graded specimen is at Miss A69 with non finer but haven't been sold yet. Now back to double die reverse, here's the most expensive lot of varieties so far. 1994 Lincoln set at Miss 66 red with FS801 designation, a lustrous pinkish red gem with none but a few extremely minor blemishes scattered about. First reported by James Mataliano, this DDR of the 1994 Lincoln Sand exhibits pronounced doubling to the final three columns of the Lincoln Memorial. But it's very challenging to see with naked eyes, so you'll need some magnification tool, loop or high definition camera for examining your paintings for double dyed columns. This top of a pop specimen was sold for $2875 in 2010 at Stax Powers. The 1991 P. Lincoln Sand is fairly common up to about MS67 condition, anything grading MS68 or higher is considered scarce and very valuable. For instance, this is 1991 Red Lincoln Sand graded at Miss Day 68 Plus by PCGS, sold on April 30th, 2017 for $1116.25 at heritage auctions. But the pinnacle among 1991 pennies is this Denver struck scent, grade at Miss Day 69 read by PCGS, the ultimate grade for registry set collectors. This is one of just three 1991D Lincoln scent certified MS69 red, separating this piece from millions of lower grade coins available. Sold on February 25th, 2022 for $11,400. Now the 1999 issue has some quite dramatic price tags, I'll talk about some little later, just bear with me. Philadelphia Mint struck more than 5 billion examples in 1999. Circulated and lower mint state pennies are in abundance out there. Even at Miss Day 60, 2 points less than perfect condition, they are worth $100 give it or take. What is likely to make big money among these pennies is wide AM variety. The close or YDM refers to distance between A and M in America on struck coins. When the A and M are normal distance apart as compared to other letters in America, this is known as a YDM. This is an intriguing modern variety that is extremely scarce and rarely offered. The reverse die with AM widely spaced was intended for proof coinage, but somehow number of Philadelphia Mint coins were struck for circulation using these dies. They are very rare in such high grade and PCGS has graded about 1000 in all grades, however this MS68 red is the sole finest graded by PCGS. Sold in 2020 for $4,582.50 at legend rare coin auctions. But ultimate pinnacle is his error, 1999 Lincoln Cent. Lincoln Cent of worst die mold with Roosevelt time reverse on a Lincoln Cent planchette. Great at Miss Day 66 read by PCGS, this incredible error somehow escaped the scrutiny of Mint employees. Only seven double denomination mules had been certified by November 2003. Interestingly, the consigner of this piece also owns two of these coins. A 1993 D cent dime on a cent planchet and a 1995 cent dime on a dime planchet. The reverse is sharply struck on figure of Lincoln and date, although the opposing dime die, being slightly smaller than the cent planchet, caused minor peripheral weakness on the reverse. 
In other words, nothing behind the periphery of the sand die to force expanding metal into recesses. Sold on April 29, 2006 for $138,000 at Heritage Auctions. Now when it comes to proof pennies of 1999, they are struck with meat mark S which stands for San Francisco Mint. They on the contrary get good value in case they have close AM on reverse. Let's take this 1999 as penny for example. Great as PR69 Deep Cameo by PCGS, virtually flawless with Georgia's copper orange surfaces, an amazing eye appeal. When the A and M are almost touching like on these splendid coins, this is known as close AM. Top notch quality for this recent variety created from proof and business struck die confusions, which ended up selling for $1035 in 2008 at Heritage Auctions. In 1993, US Mint produced more than 6 billion Lincoln cents in Denver and over 5 billion in Philadelphia. It's pretty clear that the mintage is huge and they are easy to locate at lower mint state grades. But finding superb gem like this one at, at Mint State 69 can be challenging. A lot of condition rarity is a sport satiny, virtually pristine surfaces on both sides. Otherwise, pinkish red in shade, the luster assumes swirls of liliac rose color in the center that provides a simply lovely look sold in 2010 for 4600 dollars at stacks powers when it comes to philadelphia struck 1993 pennies this must be the most expensive one also graded at mint state 69 by ngc it ended up selling for 3375 dollars this year in an ebay auction and here is an error variant that can make you hundreds of dollars if you find one like this. 1993 Lincoln sent over struck on a Roosevelt dime. Great that means stay 65 by PCGS. Letterings of overtime are fully struck, though the 9 of the date is a little bit distorted due to high points of undertype. Sold in 2013 for $646.25 at Stacks Powers. Most Lincoln cents minted in 1990s are very common since they were struck in large quantities. The 1996p Lincoln cent is no exception, as the mint struck over 6.6 .6 billion examples. Therefore, finding an example in circulation should be fairly easy. Only Examples in MS68 or higher are scarce. Anything grading lower than MS68 should be relatively easy to find or to purchase inexpensively. The most expensive regular penny of that year was showcased online. This Lincoln said that missed a 68 plus condition was bargained for $2500 in an online auction. But I also have to show you this double denomination coin. 1996 Lincoln cent struck on a 1995 dime at mid day 62. An unusual error, one showing two different dates and two distinct designs. Lustrous nickel gray with light golden toning and good cartwheel on both sides. Some minor hairlines account for a side grade. The center of verse is aligned to the dime reverse with only light rotation perhaps 30 degrees. The 6 of the cent date is visible at the base of Mi E of dime, and the 5 of cent date, though not fully defined, is able to be easily identified at E of cent, sold in 2006 for $425 at Stax Powers. The 1998 Lincoln cent has mintage of over 10 billion, making it very common. Finding one in circulation up to MS64 condition should be easy. Only in MS68 condition or higher are they considered scarce. Here is 1998 Lincoln Sand that means day 69 red. Superb gem with vibrant luster and razor sharp strike. Sold on December 19, 2021 for $2,220 at Heritage Auctions. Moving on to this proof coin of 1998, graded as PR70 red deep cameo. Absolute perfect condition with strong contrast between high design elements and mirror-like fields. At the close AM, a characteristic of the business track dies was used on a small minority of proof dies in 1998, creating this sought-after variety. This is a perfect orange-red, thoroughly contrasted example showing absolutely no trace of carbon or other impairment. Sold in 2014 for $4,406.25 at Heritage Auctions. 
Thanks for watching guys. Your subscriptions and likes are highly appreciated. See you in the next episode.